So we're stepping into a new year and it might look weird. I don't have an enlarged thumb. <laughs> this is what I'm getting rid of. Thank you, Dr. Joe. Okay, we're gonna stretch this out in just a moment. But before we do that, Dr. Laura, what what is your approach to a new year? Because I, I, I'm thinking it doesn't matter if you have a resolution. If you're not a new person, it's gonna be the same year over again. How do you approach the new year? I don't know who mandated that January 1st was the new year. My whole thing is that Every day is New Year's Day. Every day I get to recreate and be who I want to be. I get to set my intention of who I am today, what is it I want to experience in my life, and let go of yesterday or things that happen. So I, I'm not really a big one for New Year's resolutions. I know in the olden days when I do them by February, I don't even remember what they were. <laughs> that's it. <laughs> you know? And so why so, not every day be fresh? That's what, so your resolution is a daily thing though. A you resolve each day to make today better than yesterday. Is, it, would that be accurate? It, exactly. So, you want, exactly. So every day, I, you know, now that I'm getting in my, my as Dr. Joe would say, the sterling years. Sterling of, years? Is sterling that what they're years called? sterling years of my, my life. Didn't they used to be the golden years? Oh, maybe or was it? golden sterling. Yeah, yeah. It depends on the hair color that day. <laughs> anyway, what I wanted to say was, to me right now in my life is about memories. It, it's about creating, you know, we, we don't have the interaction this year as we did. I miss my granddaughters, but thank God for FaceTime yep. where I can see them and they kiss me on the phone. And, and, um, and so I guess for me, it's about wanting to cultivate the relationships in my life so that when I'm not here, they remember, oh, Grammy was so much fun. Grammy always loved me. Grammy always told me how special I am. I want them to know that they were loved. That's right. And I want to take with me those memories of joy. And so every day is about building joy and building memories. For building me. joy and building and your commitment to being a good great Grammy, a yeah. great a great mother. And a great a, a mother. Great, right. yeah, a great family member. Wait till you, wait till your daughter has her own children. That is Pretty amazing. I will wait. Yes, Thank I you know. very much. <laughs> I know. Okay, she's seven. Okay, <laughs> but, we're waiting a long time. We got to meet a guy first or a gal. Who knows? I mean, we're, we'll see what's going on. Uh, yeah, we're not rushing that. Okay. okay. Thank you, Dr. Laura. Right. The best is being a grandparent. The best is being a grandparent. Or, yeah. I don't know. Parents are pretty good too. You know, I, I as I think I alluded to a little bit earlier as well. I'm. If you're not a new person, when the new year comes in it's gonna be the same old year. You know, people keep talking about, we can't wait for 2021. It d d does it matter? It's just a roll on the calendar. You go from December 30th. It's like that toilet roll. Yeah, <laughs> well, we're gonna to get to this in a second, gang. We're gonna to get to this in a second. You go from uh, December 31st to January 1st. But if you're not a different person, it's gonna be the same day. We know that. So it's not a resolution. It's resolve on a daily basis and discipline. How am I gonna make my life the way I want it to be based on my internal discipline, my spiritual practice, and this, as Dr. Joe has alluded to, Dr. Laura, what am I willing to let go of? <laughs> Do it again. <laughs> All of it. All of it. And we want to write it down and flush it down the toilet because we can't, as we talked about, we can't do the, pay, uh, the oh, I thought you were going to throw it in the candle for oh, a second. No. Oh, no, no, no. What are we willing to let go of? That's what we're doing. Flush it down the toilet. Don't look back. As I've said, you don't flush something down the toilet and then want to bring it back up out of the toilet. Yeah. Flush it. Move on. That's what we're doing, That's right. right? You don't need that plunger to bring it back no, up. No, <laughs> why would you? You don't plunge to bring it back up. You plunge to clear it out oh, anyway. See? How far? We don't want to go down this no, rabbit no, hole no, too no. far. Okay. Yeah. Anyway. Just, just, just have every day be the new year, the new day. Set that intention for joy and laughter and love and memories and be part of that. That's what we're up to. Yeah. And at Center for Spiritual Living Palm Desert in 2021, we are building a bridge to the best year ever. Make it that. We love you. Thank love you. Love you. Happy New Year. Happy New Year.